Lemonade stands and lawn mowing used to be the go-to ways for kids to earn some money and start learning about personal finance. But a trio of Missoula relatives may be reinventing the wheel when it comes to making money at a young age. MTN's Megan Mannering caught up with the Colson family to learn what it takes to be an entrepreneur. Pint-sized and poised, Missoula has a new businessman in town. He travels with his colleagues, both of whom share the same entrepreneurial spirit and the same last name. Ages seven, eight, and nine, these three dream in quarters and candy. Meet the Colsons. They have machines too. So they all have machines too. So. He has one, she has two, three. And I have nine machines. When he was just six, a lazy day of scrolling through YouTube led Ezra Colson and his father to a video about vending machines. And like getting your favorite flavor of gumball with your very last quarter, the stars aligned. We saw videos and this guy was like filling up his machines and we got interested into the idea. So then I kind of got interested and then I started doing it for like one year. Then my sister turned six and then she started to do it and then we started to build it up. Once a month the family makes their rounds to a total of 13 vending machines all owned and operated by the Colson kids. Places like Billion Auto Kia, Lithia Ford, Mildenberger Motors. I got one barber shop but then we noticed that these places are the ones that make the most money. With their own credit cards, Ezra, his sister Eden, and their cousin Moses purchase the candy from a grocery store. They fill up the machines, run a quick test, and collect their earnings. For Ezra, these will go towards his next business venture. Think quarters, but with higher stakes. Save it for a laundry mat. Big one. Chauffeur and financial advisor Daniel Colson keeps the group grounded, sprinkling in lessons on finance amid the giggles. I really wanted them to learn about like the key things of passive income and invest your money. So put your money to work for you. So buy these machines that could help you out. And then obviously he's going to start to learn once he has to plug in these machines, he's now going to have to learn that, hey, you got to now split some profit with the companies you go into because you're using their electricity. But the biggest lesson of all, the responsibility that comes with a handshake. In Missoula, Megan Mannering, MTN News.